hello guys welcome to a new video today guys i'm going to show you how you can make a carpet duper as you can see over here we have a carpet duper it is duping the carpets into our furnace and we get infinite fuel by that um okay yeah and i will walk you through the whole tutorial and what to do and what to don't do you need a slime block you need two slime blocks one sticky piston uh one uh sorry two redstone repeaters uh, you need redstone dust depends on like what is the uh, place that you're building but you need redstone dust about 10 to 30 um, You need one carpet any kind of carpet. It could be white or any kind You need one hopper. You can it can be more uh, I prefer you taking two hoppers um, Because you can also connect the chest to the furnace um, Yeah, you need two chests if you want if you don't want then you cannot take those but in my opinion take two chests you need glass i mean any kind of blocks i will take glass so i can actually see what's happening through the farm uh you need furnace or uh, redstone torch gra uh, grass block and some uh, any kind of block yeah you don't need exactly grass block i just i'm just taking this so if i mess up everything i have i can actually fix it so start up by putting a temporary block over here this, you can actually remove this later uh, place a piston now be sure the collection system should be at the uh, should be behind the piston So if the piston is facing over there the collection system will be here uh, So for example, we will place a piston over there for example Now I can break this block now put one two uh, Blocks of slime just like this take your carpet and put it on top of the piston now this is your uh, carpet duper that's done now you can activate it deactivate it you watch where you want to do it but for the sake of the tutorial i will show you how you can get that so go ahead put a redstone torch underneath your uh, piston go ahead and dig a uh, about a 5x5 five five block area would be pretty good 4x4 four four is enough take your uh, redstone repeaters put one of them like this and one of them like that so they should face two other um directions now make sure that you put them on the last speed because if this farm is really fast it is gonna actually break after a while uh so yeah make sure that you put it on the lowest speed and bring it exactly so the uh this one should be at the bottom layer and it should face towards the um the rest on torch if it is like this it is not facing towards okay now this is facing towards the block that has the rest on torch on now this is your um, your song clock over, uh, done over here. Now you basically made it automatic. Uh, now you just need to go ahead and take your glass and um, and just go ahead and lead the blocks, uh, the carpets to your collection system. You can put uh, you can put a block over here exactly, and go two blocks up and break the two middle blocks. Do the same for the other direction, uh, the other um, way. There we go. Now just go ahead, go back one, and just go ahead and uh, put, uh, just connect the two blocks. Now you can extend the same block that has the piston. Now two blocks different after piston. I think it's um, it's a lot. So the best the best uh, way that you can do is to just put uh, one block after the piston and then your hopper. So yeah, that's what you want to do for now. Um, okay, now just go ahead and put your furnace over here so if you put your hopper over here uh you need to put your furnace over here so this is really important guys okay the furnace should face towards uh, the um hopper should first towards the furnace uh, from the side it shouldn't be at the top if it is at the top it's gonna mess up everything it should be at the side just like that now you can go ahead take some glass and cover up the furnace also the sides also because you don't want to miss anything now I prefer going two more blocks up just to be safe and don't miss out on any other carpets okay yeah I forgot you also you can you can do this you can also connect your furnace to your chest over here just like that and um, yeah now let's go ahead and activate the farm this is a bit tricky so make sure that you do it really fast you need to place a redstone torch or any uh, redstone activator block uh, next to this redstone over here and remove it as fast as possible yes just like that 
um yeah as you can see over here the farm is now um working as you can see the coppers are being duped they will go to the hopper and the hopper will uh, bring them to here so you can actually cook stuff with this if i go ahead and take some uh pork chops over here for example you can actually cook stuff with this you can uh, put this in a blast furnace any kind of furnace and it will actually work the stuff that are collected will uh go to uh we'll go to the chest over here and if you want a tutorial of how you can make an super smelter i also will leave the link of the tutorial down in the description of how you can make a auto smelter or super smelter i also had other tutorials of how you can get infinite fuel source but that's only for food this is for everything for black for blast furnace for the normal furnace any kind of furnace this will work as you can see over here this is really efficient you can make this faster but i'm saying is it will break after time the carpets will actually break and if like the carpet broke or anything you can just go ahead and replace the hard uh, replace the carpet back to the piston and the farm will work again and yeah that's how you can make an automatic carpet duper unfortunately this form won't work for bedrock edition so this is on for java thank you so much for watching this video if you have any questions feel free to ask me in the comment section and i will see you on the next one and bye